Greetings, it's Sally Tisha's YouTube. Welcome to another episode of the vlog. How's everyone doing today? Hope you guys are all doing fantastic. Welcome to a new video, vlog. Check it out. It is raining out there and it's raining. <laughs> So it's it, it it stopped raining like this morning and the sun came out for a second and then like after that it was just like a downpour since then. It's not raining too hard, but it's definitely raining. Um so yeah. But we have a lot of things to do today, so I'm gonna take you guys on a little adventure. Let's go. Alright you guys, we just left the house and I have like the world's largest umbrella. There's a mom and John right there. We're getting into the car, we're heading out to have sushi. I'm so excited. We got to the restaurant and our first roll came out. Yeah, more of a sushi king. And some more sushi. Greetings, it's South Asian YouTube. It's Hedron here. How's everyone doing today? Hope you guys are all doing fantastic. Welcome to a new video. Today is a new episode of Goodwill Hunting. So we're going to be going into a Goodwill. I'm super excited to take you guys in there with me. And if you guys love thrifting, you love thrift hauls, and you love vlogs, don't forget to subscribe. Hit the little bell button for notifications. And don't forget to check out my Instagram and Facebook. It's Hadrian, just like it's spelled here. And check out my shop at itshadrian.com to see what I have for sale from my thrifted adventures. But without further ado, let's go into the store and see what we can find. All right, you guys, we just got to the Goodwill. Let's go inside and check it out. I think there's a Fendi in there. And a coach. There's a coach, but it's 25. And the patent is super cracking, so that's a no. Capizio. This is that fake coach. The ore, maybe. I think it's fake. They still have this vintage Juni here, which is kind of kind of cute. It's in really good shape, but a bunch of Ipsy cases. This Steve Madden bag is kind of cute, but it's pleather. Lola. Is this a fossil bag? No, Morona. That print like a fossil. It's still like super bare here. Still trying to replenish all the bags. This little seashell box is kind of cute. It's $4.99. I'm just looking through the knickknacks. I did look through the bags at the front. The coach was $20. A little pricey for a bag that was that small and it was kind of dirty. The Fendi was $89.99 but at least it was authentic. I'm pretty sure almost 100% but um it's fabric and had a couple little stains on it but $100 or it was almost $100 so too much I think. Oh look at this seashell thing. $5.99. <laughs> I actually kind of like it, but no. Alright, looking through the knickknacks. Hey, look at that. That definitely looks very vintage. A wine rack, tables, this desk is still here. All right, you guys, just got inside the car. Didn't actually get anything. There was just nothing really um, that I liked in the store other than uh, maybe the Fendi and the Coach bags, but they were so expensive, so I didn't end up picking them up. Um, maybe the Fendi will stick around. Like, I think I would pay... It was 89 so if it goes a half off, it'll be $45. Um, that might be a good price for it, but um, we'll see if it even stays here for that long. Um, but... I just noticed that like all these cars used to are in the back. I look like a dad. <laughs> but now let's go home. Um, just wanna straighten up the my room, and I'm gonna film a 
haul video for on um, the stuff that we got at the Powder Born Outlet. So if you guys did not see that video from this morning, um, we did end up going to the Powder Born Outlet and got a few things. So I'm super excited to share those items with you. Um, so check out this morning's video. And if you guys don't know, I do do two videos a day, one at 7 a.m. Pacific Standard Time and one at 2 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. The morning one is usually like a shopping or a thrift or a haul video. And then the afternoon, evening time, um, it's a uh, vlog. So let's go back home and see what mom's thinking for dinner. Hey guys, okay, so we had dinner. We just pretty much had leftovers from like the past few days um, and didn't really eat too much because I was still kind of full from sushi. But, oh, check this out. So this is a one of the things that we got from today when we went to the Pottery Barn outlet. And I am seriously so obsessed with it. Like, look at how pretty it looks with like just these plates. Like, this tray, you can use so many things with it and it's like amazing. So if you guys wanna see um, our shopping trip, check out this morning's video. We went to Pottery Barn outlet and we got some really great stuff. So I am very, very excited and I'm gonna be doing the spring decor very soon. <laughs> I know I keep saying that, but I've just been like so busy and it's been raining and it's just like a hot mess. But now I'm gonna clean up here because the kids made a little bit of a mess. And as you can see, one of the things is missing right there that sh like the glass two-tiered shelf is gone. Mom actually took it and put it in her bathroom and it is looking fantastic. Um, I, I guess I, I can show you that. I can show you guys that tomorrow. I think, actually, I'll show you guys how it looks. Mom has like a little display there now, but um, yeah, I'm just gonna clean up here. I don't know why I keep showing you the dirty kitchen, but um, there's just so many things everywhere I need to clean. Uh... Hey guys, okay, so I'm inside my room and I just wanted to end the video here. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with me today. I had so much fun. The rain is intense. It's still started raining again. It actually stopped raining for just a little bit, um, but then it started raining back again, or raining again, and it has been a little intense. Um, but I think it's supposed to stop raining tomorrow, or at least, like, only rain at night or something, and then, um, yeah, but rain is always good. The only thing is I just hate driving in the rain. It's, like, not my favorite thing, um, but on another note, I am very excited that I finally got my ring light. Like I got, I have um, an Alexa and I got one of those little, they're like these little um, things that you plug into the wall and you can control them with her. So watch, look, if I say Alexa, turn off ring light. Will it work? Alexa, turn off ring light. Oh. Alexa, turn off ring light. Okay. There it goes. <laughs> of course, like the time I'm trying to show you guys how awesome it is, it doesn't work. But Alexa, turn on ring light. Okay. Yeah, so I'm really excited about that. Um, it's just really annoying to turn, like there's like a little knob thing underneath the, um, the light and it's just like, ugh, like it drives me nuts. So it's kind of cool to be able to turn it on and off. I can just really, I can plug in whatever I want into the thing and it turns on. And it was pretty cheap. I think it was under $15 on Amazon. And it's actually one of like the cheaper things like that. Cause normally like the other ones that I've seen that are actually for the, um, the Alexa thing, um, they're really expensive. So I was glad to see that there was one for a pretty reasonable price. Um, yeah, they're like really cool. I I kind I have two of them actually. I have one for that, and then I have another one for um that I have for my box for my uh, what's it called my shadow box light thing. Um, and that one I have another one for it because that one the the, the weird thing about the shadow box is that it doesn't actually have a like an on and off switch. You literally have to pull, like unplug the like the thing out of the box which is really weird and I don't know I don't like it so um I like will use the thing to like turn it on and off just because like if I'm leaving the room I just don't want to leave it on 
Um, so like I'll be able to turn it on and off really easily without having to like unplug and plug it back in like every time I need to turn it on and off. So that's pretty cool. Um, so yeah, I kind of really like them. I think I'm going to get them for my parents in their room. Because now that I've like used this and it's like really cool, I'm like really excited about it. So, um, but yeah. That's my little update for right now. Um, but thank you guys so much again for hanging out with me today. I had a blast. Tomorrow is Friday. And then Saturday, on Saturday, we're going to go somewhere really fun. So not only are we going to go thrifting, but we're going to um, another kind of cool event um, that I was invited. Like, I was actually pretty surprised I was invited to it. Um, I've never really been invited to any of these. I don't, I don't even know what kind of event it really is. But, um, I talked to other people and, like, they didn't get invited. So I don't know if it's maybe... So, I don't know. I don't even want to say exactly what it is. Um, but I will definitely tell you guys about it on Saturday. And if I can vlog there, I definitely will. And... That should be really fun. I'm really excited about that. But I'm also really excited to go thrifting because Saturday's thrifting day. So I, I just want to go out and go see what they have. Um, my hair is just like out of control. I also really want to get a haircut. But I don't want to get a haircut when it's raining. Because I feel like every time I get a haircut when it's like really cold, I get sick. And I think it's because like my head's not used to not having like all this hair around it and then I get my head gets really cold and then I get sick or something but um yeah I don't even know why I'm talking about this but um I love you guys so so much don't forget to subscribe hit the little bell button for notifications and tune back in tomorrow for a new video love you guys so so much I'll see you guys then my spot mom she's looking at the planters already hello mother hey look at that little one right there the little teeny one huh Is this the one we have? It is, right? Mm -hmm. That's my is this the one we got? That's the one we got. Yeah, beautiful. But this is the one we have, right? Or is this a little yeah, smaller? The one that 